you're using the wrong primaries. That's right. Today, we're going to break down the best three long range primaries currently in Warzone with the season five update. This gun's hacking, bro. The best long range meta from Warzone 3 season two has returned. That's right, with all the new iterations of the season five update, this Warzone 3 season two meta LMG makes its return to the top of the list. With the season five update, Warzone added two things, a brand new primary and as well as two brand new attachments to Warzone. The STG makes a triumphant return from Warzone 1. That's right, the Vanguard STG has returned to Warzone and it's pretty much the same primary from then. Low recoil, high damage at mid and short range, but at long range, it does unfortunately struggle. But with the brand new attachments that were added to Warzone, it's gonna make this gun better than ever. But is it the best? Let's find out today. The two attachments that we're talking about today is the Quartermaster Suppressor. Um, all you have to do is unlock a daily challenge. Uh, for this one, you have to unlock eight daily challenges. Just load into a multiplayer match and you'll be able to unlock it. And then as well as the Paracord Grip is a brand new attachment. Both of these attachments are built for horizontal recoil and sprint and fire, aiming idle sway, and as well as aiming walk steadiness. I mean, it makes the gun have the lowest recoil, as well as having better aim down sights. So we're gonna hop in here and go through the three best long range primaries in Warzone. And leading off at number three is the STG. Yes, it makes a triumphant return, but the one thing it struggles with is long range damage. That's right. It's short to medium range is so dominant compared to the other two primaries that we're going to talk about, but it does struggle at long range. And what we're focusing on today is the long range. Though the SCG is really good at resurgence maps like Rebirth and Fortune's Keep, it's going to struggle on Vondale, which have a longer engagement and as well as Big Mac. Coming in at number two, we have one of my favorites of all time. It's the G36 LMG, the Holger 2.6. This thing has been good for a while now with low recoil, high fire rate, and good damage at long range. The only thing that is going to sacrifice with the build that we're going to show today is that you have to use the iron sights. A lot of people need that scope or need that optic to help them at long range, but this thing is so good at long range. And if you play on controller, you get better aim assist with the lower optics or using the iron sights versus the bigger optics or the, the optics that see longer. So our build today is going to be an iron sights build if you struggle with that feel free to swap out one of the other attachments i would encourage swapping out the under barrel for an optic the eagle eye and this will make this gun number two on our list and coming in at number one this lmg makes its triumphant return from season one to be the meta this primary got a bunch of buffs with the season five update and with other primaries floor being lower to either lower damage range or lower fire rates or lower pull up velocity this one has peaked its head out to be the best primary in warzone at long range and that's the attack eradicator we're going to be using the iron size today but you can also switch out one of these attachments for an optic but i encourage you to use this build because this thing fries at short medium and long range super low recoil has great pull up velocity and it checks all the boxes to be the best long range event in but don't take my word for it. Check out the gameplay. Let me know down in the comments what primary you're currently using in Warzone. And we'll test it out in the next video. Hello and welcome back to the channel. My name is Bearded, live from the Captain's Quarters. And if you're new here and want to find your way, and the easiest thing to do is click that like button, click that subscribe button, smash the bell logo so you'll get a notification for when the next video goes live. And like we always say, keep blundering, keep scuttling, keep getting that booty, baby. The loadouts for this attack eradicator is going to be throughout the video, so make sure you tune in. We'll catch you in the next video. Such a bitch, bro. This gun's hacking, bro.
How is there no ammo in there? This gun kind of pops, in all honesty. Fire sale active. My station prices have been reduced. We made it top 25. Well done. That's a mistake, bro. Yes, sir. 